Well, Charlotte Catholic Cougars coming off the deck at halftime, down 14 to nothing, and then uh, winning going away as the breaks went their way, and they took advantage of some wonder turnovers, and they will move on into the third round next week. Let's go field side. Here's Woody Kane. Thanks, Randy. Well, Coach Odo, what a great comeback by your team. What did you tell your kids in the locker room at halftime? I begged and pleaded and cried <laughs> and, and, and asked them to respond, and, and they did. We, we didn't change any blocking schemes. We just tried to go out a little harder, and we were getting one and two, we start getting three and four, and kids got after a little bit better and picked it up. And of course, we got breaks, but they got breaks the first half, so, you know, that's the way the ball game goes. I, I have empathy for them, but I, not that much. <laughs> and, and the difference between the two halves was, was special, but the turnovers helped seem to jumpstart your team. Oh, yeah. We, we, we got some breaks, you know. And, of course, they had, you know, they got the black punt down there, and they had some, some things, too. So, you know, I, I, I hope it evens out. But this is just a good ball game. I'm just happy we won the darn thing. Do you know any details about the, the injured players yet? Well, he's got a dislocated kneecap. He's gone for the season, and he's... He's a big spark for us. He's, he's our speed, right. uh, and, and we count heavily on him. But you know, you go to war with the soldiers you got. <laughs> right. All right, Coach. Well, congratulations and thanks for your time. Thank you. Okay, Randy, back to you. Okay, thanks, Woody. And of course, uh, Catholic will be at home in the third round next week. They'll take on the Charlotte Olympic or Sun Valley winner in round number three. Back in just a bit.